1977, Mattel introduced the Shokum Warriors line, which included Godzilla. And today, we will be taking a look at that toy, which I have in my collection. Everybody, welcome to Creed's Collection. And this is going to be my Godzilla. Hey, there he is. I think I'll grab him real quick off the shelf. Okay, here he is in all his Godzilla glory. He is a very large toy, standing a whopping 19 inches tall. Uh, that is enormous. Uh, this is one of my childhood toys. Uh, he does have some wear, but mostly he is in mint condition. Uh, as you can see, he uh, has really great paint still. The switch on the back of his neck is still functional. Uh, you use that switch to activate his atomic breath, as you can see here. And instead of making him walk, you actually just push him around. They included wheels on his feet, and it makes it easy for him to attack unsuspecting action figures. So of course this toy was produced in conjunction with Toho, the company that invented Godzilla. They produced the movies. Uh, last week in my blog, I called him a Takara Godzilla, and of course that's the company that made Transformers. So in addition to his atomic breath and his wheeled feet, he also has a right hand that launches, which I have two of, because I used to have another one of these toys, and as you can see, it's a slightly different color. There's a button on his right arm, right at the elbow joint, and that is actually what you use to launch the arm, the claw, I guess, out. And it still works, and it launches pretty far. Three, two, one. There's a side shot of that too, so you have an idea of how far it goes. Um, here he is next to He-Man. He-Man is about a six and a half inch figure, so this will really show you, like, he's enormous compared to a regular action figure. And he frequently would attack Castle Grayskull and other figures in my collection. Here he is also next to a uh, Spider-Man classic seven inch figure on the right. Well guys, I appreciate you checking out the first episode of Creed's Collection. Uh, these reviews are going to be short and sweet, and I'm just going to check out toys that I grew up with, uh, toys that I still have. Um, some of them are going to be in bad shape, some of them are going to be in good shape. I mean, they did get played with. But uh, I hope to see you guys next Wednesday, and every Wednesday after, for Creed's Collection.